Hi, back again to a new tutorial part uh, in Blender. Um, we did in my last tutorial on my YouTube channel this um, tank chain, tank tracks, and uh, if I grab here and X, you see uh, the chain moves, but not the wheels. And today I will show you how we do that to move the wheels with them with drivers. So we start at empty. On um, the empty we place here in the middle somewhere. Such like that. Then we get this wheel should be moved in the direction with this empty. So first select that hold shift select the empty control P and set parent to object now when we move that empty grab X it moves with them but uh, it don't turns so we need there a driver that means we go to the object in the object datas and there we have the rotation in the y-axis of this object y-axis you see here this green one so it means it turns down so here we add a driver so right mouse button and go to add driver we see now here the values uh, important is that we search here the empty so object empty and we see it is here in this um, purple that means there is a driver on that now um, and we can edit that right mouse button on it edit driver so we have it here again and here we see what happens then um, he takes from the MTDX location and that value where is a, a variable uh, you can from programming there's the same and there you can take mathematic uh, operations with this where variable and um, so we have done that on the Y axis so that means when we move now grab X you see it rotates when it moves forward but it rotates to to less I would say so what we do we go on this object edit the driver and give them here another plus we give them here multiply so multiply 3 or 4 I take a 4 when we now move that grab X yeah you see it goes much faster that is wonderful so what we do next we copy the driver to this one so we click that one go to the driver copy driver then we go to the next object and on the y-axis and paste driver so when we now move that <laughs> will one happen that goes with the object that believes standing but rotate so grab x and y because it is not parented to the empty so we take first that sh hold shift right click on the empty control p set parent to object now both grab X move with the empty that's good for now but we want the chain goes with them so we take here the curve that we have and hold shift click right on the empty control P object parents are set it grab X and you see now the change uh, chain and the wheel turns with them 
there are different sizes of uh, wheels and they must turn faster than that one when we look here we have here much of them and so we can't animate that so for that we must delete some uh, must look here that we delete the half uh, as I said before you can see that whole tutorial in to build this chain and all the stuff on my YouTube channel it's for free you can build a complete tank so that wheel uh, we want to separate so control P in the edit mode separated we have that wheel and we also need that top wheel so we click with L you can select singular objects now one back okay then to separate normally it's directly with control P or P no it doesn't work okay so we hit uh, spacebar then you can search for the function and there we have it and then by selected now we have that singular on that singular now we can get them these drivers too so we can go on that wheel and copy here the driver and paste it to that one paste uh, must go here back control C I think they are not now applied so we have to apply that objects before the rotation scale because of that are singular objects now so the whole data must be refreshed good so we can copy paste here the driver move them a little bit down grab Z so uh, when we now move that must be rotate so grab X <laughs> oh that's wrong angle my friend uh, so here it needs the pivot point at the right uh, place so the origin so set origin to geometry origin to geometry I must look shift s uh, selection to active Let's look. No, it don't work. Oh, some actions are cool. Select it. We can make that object set origin to geometry. Now we have it. So when I now move that, grab X, ah, grab X, then you see the down one rotates too, but it is too slow and it don't move with them. So we parent that here too, Control P, and parent that. Then we need here a stronger, faster turn. It is four times um, faster than the original one there so we have here uh, maybe a 16 or such we 
simply try that and then we move that grab X and we see that moves much faster than the other ones and so we build that with all of the rest of them and then we have here a nice floating tank animation for wheels thanks a lot for watching and see us in the next tutorial please subscribe my channel without that i must stop the projects on youtube so it's important that you subscribe that i make can go on with tutorials thanks a lot